Hi. Forest is in the forest. Oh. I'm not sure what the reception's like here, people. So let me know if I break up at any point. Probably going to crack up at some point this evening because I'm in the middle of nowhere. My lace is undone. I just trod on it again. Here's John hiding. And we just um, basically come out for an investigation. Um, traipse through brambles and leg breaking terrain. And I said, oh, I can see a piece of grass. So we've come here, I'll show you. I'll try not to break my neck. Oh, foliage. <clears throat> so we found this piece of grass that I saw from standing on a hill. Check out how exciting it is. <gasps> Portal. So we're just investigating this at the moment. Let me uh, take you over. A wren flew out into my face um, and I nearly needed a change of clothing. But it looks like, let's see if I can turn the old camera around. Oh, there we go. So we've got steps, remnants of a building, big hole. Snapping away, and also over here, let me carry you through the woods. We have another section hiding behind. I'm stuck on a tree. Ugh. I have no idea what this was or what it was used for. No, we, it is literally just a random find. There's a pipe over there as well. Do you think this was? A basement? Corner. I mean, weren't there military exercises around here as well? Mm -hmm. There you go guys, hoping my phone's not going to fall off the old selfie <laughs> stick. Because <laughs> I'm not going in that stagnant mess. So, that's where we are. Let me turn you back around so you can see my wonderful face. Because we know that's all what you're tuned in for. <laughs> and that lovely beautiful face just there. <laughs> We've just met. It's like forest on tour, and John's joining me, so... I think something just bit my bum. Me, that's bright. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just testing out the old IR oh, yeah. camera. I'm, I'm, I'm flashing no, no, it's, it doesn't seem to affect it. Oh, I can hear a hooty owl. Here's John looking like an extra from the Blair Witch. And this is what we can see. Was it polio? I think something like that, yeah. Polio or some sort of disease that gave them black eyes. So I kind of hope we get some activity tonight, but I'm almost quite up for not seeing children with black eyes staring at me in at the woods. How about you, John? I have to say, children are my kryptonite with scary stuff, so if we did have a black eyed child appear to us, <laughs> I'm going to have to really stand firm in not running away screaming <laughs> <laughs> into the night. <laughs> but there's not, it's not just those, there's monks, there's um, witchcraft that's apparently been done here and sightings of witches. So there's, there's, it's a hot spot for pretty much everything really. I wonder if I could connect to any witches. Got a wet bum now where I've sat on that leg, on that grass. I hope it's because I sat on the wet it's grass. It's a hot spot for cryptids as well. What are they? Um, legendary animals. So Ooh. there could be 
wild black large cats out here. That's quite a common occurrence with sightings. Um, there's even been stories of werewolves and the pig man as the well. The pig man. You know, that's the sort of thing I take with a pinch of salt personally. Mm, but... Scratchings though, they're pretty salty. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> if he appears to us, well, <laughs> that's on him. Pig really. man, I might have the munchies in about an hour. <laughs> would help if I take the lens cap off. Rookie mistake. So here we have the steps, people. And I've set up ye flashing moulds there, there, and there. Woohoo! Disco. And then we've got the old REM pod, which will go off if you touch any part of it even underneath, as you can see. So, we're going to ask out, that was my boot, I might add, that noise, nothing more. <laughs> <laughs> um, so we're going to start asking out now because it's all in pretty dark. Are there any spirits here with us tonight? If there are, can you make yourself known? Got dancing bugs. It's um, it's an unnerving environment, I think, psychologically. I think we're not on our own out here, and that somebody's watching out for us that knows the land a bit better. Can you tell us a name? If there's anybody here, let us know who you are. I like that this app actually has electromagnetic reader on there as well, which actually does work because I've tested it at home near electrics and things and it goes right up. Okay. Um, Let's have a look and see if my camera will pick it up. <coughs> the people that made this Always. app might probably just be nothing. But um, the people that made this up have got a YouTube channel, Australians. Okay. Uh, Amy's Crypt, have you ever come across her? No. Did that say always? Mm hmm. Always. Always what? What are you trying to tell us? What was the last thing I said? Something about it would be nice if somebody was watching over us. Yeah. Was this building used for anything important? Original. Yeah. But the, the thing that... Yes. Is that yes? Yeah. It's for storage or hunters. So did hunters use this building? Or was it used to store things? When something like that happens, my chills. Go yeah, off. it's quite definitive, wasn't it? Can you tell us what's in the plastic bag down in the old building? Not sure I want to know the answer <laughs> to that question. Zoom in on John's face. <laughs> <laughs> Is there anything sinister happening here? Oh. 
hi. <laughs> I just go to tube app and we've had a yes. Um, and then I started asking questions about whether this place was sinister, uh, whether there was a sinister use here. And it just said down. Um, and previous to that, I just asked about what was in the plastic bag that was down there, which is kind of human shaped and freaked us out earlier. So, yeah, still waiting to see the black eyed children. Hi, Scott. Thanks for sending me out into the woods with <laughs> strange men that I've never met before. It's an awesome opportunity. I do love you. So, I'm sorry you can't see my wonderful face very well. I'll try and illuminate it a little <laughs> bit better for you. John's got his uh, little kind of like a yeah, floodlight. I've become a street there, lamp. Which is good because that means he's going to be attracting all the mosquitoes. <laughs> so I'm just going to step over here a bit. <laughs> there we go. So we're just kind of hanging around this building. I mean, I don't know how we're going to get back to the car because it's uh, very Cross. thorny. <laughs> This is why I brought a, a tarp and pegs, just in yeah. case. John's know. come prepared. He's got um, a tarp. First aid kit. <laughs> First aid kit. I don't know what he's planning. <laughs> it's all an adventure, guys. Scott says you look like a burglar. <laughs> well, I'm doing my stealth Let, mode. Let's thing. just... Does he? No. Oh, I thought I he was... I actually, yeah. I've got, yeah, I've got burglar chic going on. You're like on. a beano burglar. <laughs> <laughs> We'll have a stripy jacket on by the end of the night. <laughs> I've also got my ghost box as well, which is quite noisy, but we will put that on in a little while. And it's very quiet here, guys. I'm not sure if we're going to get any activity. Like I say, we've got a couple of words from John on his ghost tube app. I keep forgetting the name of it. And it happens so rarely that I, it makes me trust it more, you know? Yeah, it doesn't just churn out words, does it? No, it doesn't, it doesn't do anything for me at home. How about... If we use both torches, you might be able to... See, hang on. There was definitely some comings and goings here, because that looks like it was either a road or a path at one time. So yeah, there's like avenues of trees that way, and kind of behind us as well that way wasn't it yeah it goes all the way up but it's how long ago that's the only thing that's hard to tell isn't it could be quite okay so we're going to continue to ask out guys for a bit um and we'll be back in about 15 20 minutes or so I said something at the same time Ooh, we caught that one guys we've got um on john's app come through the name Anne, and this ghost box is really trying hard to communicate but it's not very clear Tell me if you can hear it clearly. Is there someone called Anne with us at the moment? 